trapping leg. Let's talk about the little principle we call trapping leg. And trapping leg is because we use our leg to trap. What do we trap? Here. We trap his legs. This is trapping leg because here I can push him down or I can push and then pull again. I can just pull without the pushing and then push down again. So the basic movement is this. I can do it from the inside and push. I can do it from the inside and take his leg away. I can do the trap the trapping leg from the opposite direction like into Lauma. It's not only from the outer direction but also from the inside. So the inward direction is this. See? I'm using the forward compass principle and I just bypass an obstacle. This is an obstacle, which is not clear. I bypass this obstacle. After I bypass this obstacle, I'm in trapping leg. I can also bypass it from the inside, my inside direction, into Lauma. Into Lauma stand, here. So if I'm doing, if I bypass the obstacle from here, I can use the trapping leg to continue my movement into backward compass principle and take fear. If I'm using the, for the inward lauma here, I can just continue with forward compass principle and kick him with round kick. So it allows me to bypass multiple people sometimes. And this is the main usage. Trapping other people legs with my legs and how do we trap it you see i have an angle between my leg and his leg i lock his ankle with my foot i touch him completely and then i i pushing his shin with my shin i can do it from the backward direction direction i can do it from the forward direction very unpleasant and how do I lift his leg? Because when I push him, he shifts his weight. So he won't fall. If his weight is here, he will just fall. So he, push, he shifts his weight. When his weight is on the other leg, I can take this leg. This is how it works.